<laughs> Alright, okay. Well, since we don't have any information about how our weeks went, and to be honest with you, like I don't really, I don't really got none for that either <laughs> this week. But how you not feel about letting other niggas fuck your girl? It's never Ain't gonna no happen. Way. It's Ain't never no happening. <laughs> Ain't no way. Nigga. <laughs> that's a like crazy life. Niggas get so sensitive <laughs> when you start talking about the queen, bro. Bro, not my baby. What right, queen? Okay. <laughs> Man's a queen. <laughs> <laughs> All right, okay. All right. So would you rather she was fucking a, another nigga behind your back or you just going, neither. I neither. <laughs> I, don't, I don't, but if you had to bro, choose one. You choose plus <laughs> <three>. <laughs> Single lifestyle, my Single. Bro. Single. <laughs> all right, okay, all right. I'm trying to have a conversation. All right. Okay. Right. Say, for example, you start dating this girl. Yeah. Right. I'm with you, yeah. And you look, you look fall in love with each other. Right? Mm-hmm. With you. Yeah. And then you find out that while you, you lot was doing all the love, all the love shit, you've been dating for maybe seven, five, seven years, long relationship, Ooh. invested, Ooh. thinking about having kids type of situation. Yeah. And then she's like, I'm not going to lie to you, bro. Your dick's not enough. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> That's wait, crazy. wait, There's wait, no way, wait, <laughs> wait. Let's, let me, let me finish. Let me finish. Let me finish. So she says that. And then she's like, how do you feel? about having an open marriage. Well, I can go out and have a one night stand with a random guy that I'm never going to speak to ever again and just to satisfy my sexual pleasure. Or maybe there's some shit that you don't do. You don't eat the booty, but she likes her booty eating. And she's like, I have this booty eater on my phone. (laughs) And he ready. I call him Friday nights. We do that. Nothing more, nothing less. You might might not into that. No. No. <laughs> no. Like you actually lost me. <laughs> yeah. Okay. That's it, that's so it. would you rather her do that or her say to you, I mean I'm not choosing bro, Because your dick no no, I've been fucking this guy that you didn't know about. You've been fucking for two years. You don't have kids now at this point. And she said that mortgage. to your face. Yeah. Nigga. I can't even lie at that point. It's like <laughs> You think do you think nowadays do you think these women have these women have any Compassion for us. I mean, look at it like this, bro. Boy, at that point, I'm like, is the kid even mine at that point? You saying you fucking this guy for two? You got kids? Wait, she has yeah. kids. Yeah, apparently, no, apparently, we got kids that you've been here like five, seven because years, and she's been fucking a guy for two years. There's a chance of one of them kids and not it's mine. Not yours, yeah. yeah, that is because, wild. Because I, I'm the, suing. The, the <coughs> argument that most women make, most women that I have conversations, I don't like anyway, this ultimate is that they don't like to, they don't like to come up with because I. I was talking to this girl. I'm not obviously. I'm not going to mention anyone's names. Anyway. Oh, yeah. I was talking to this girl, and <clears throat> she cheats on her boyfriend. Mad. Right, and I asked her like, "Yo, why you why you do that? Like, don't you feel some type of way when you go home? Because this nigga don't know that she's she's fucking other people, right? Don't you feel some type of way when you get back home and like, because she actually is in love with this nigga. That's the weird part. No, no. Listen, that's the weird part for me. <laughs> Because I'm like, you're laid up, not with me. <laughs> you're, laid <up. laughs> you're laid up with other niggas, right? Mm. But while you're with other niggas, you're talking about your boyfriend, who you love a lot. Mm. Do you get what I'm saying? Like, you don't have a plan to, to live life together. Like, he's, this nigga is a proper stand-up nigga. Like, I'm starting to feel bad for the nigga. Like, no. Do you get what I'm saying? You- but the reason why she would go out behind his back and fuck other guys is because she doesn't feel comfortable... Telling him that sexually she needs more. Does that make sense? No. So now she feels like. <laughs> no, no, it doesn't. Does that make it doesn't make sense. Wait, it doesn't make sense at all. It, no, makes, sense. it makes a little bit of sense to me. That's because wild. I've been, I've been in a relationship where I felt like her pussy was not enough, or like the sexual, this, the, the sexual shit that we was doing after a while wasn't enough to just be like, cool, I'm satisfied. Does that make sense? You gotta have and a And in that moment. You gotta have a conversation. I, that's what that's what I did. But as men, we're open to doing that with women. We're open to I even suggested I was younger, so I suggested having an open relationship. Obviously, she ain't going for that. But <laughs> as a nigga, you would do that. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. That's why I was asking her, like, yo, you love this guy. You say you care about see, him. See, see, see. But that, listen, listen. Is that love word? But is she does, word? but she yeah, does love actually love him. Can't coincide. She does. Do you know do you know, do you know why I say she does actually love him? Because it's easier for her to just leave this nigga and just fuck all these guys that she's fucking that's, already. That's, anyway, do you know how easy... That doesn't equal love, though. I feel like that. That doesn't equal love, I thought that's monkey punching. 
There's what? Monkey branch. First, like, you, first just, you just with a nigga and then oh, you're looking for someone, a better yeah. option. And then okay. when, when you find like a better one, you go where the grass is greener, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. I feel like you lot are misunderstanding what I'm saying. Okay. She's in love with this nigga. She's not trying to leave this nigga. All the other niggas because, she's seen, yeah, just because what I'm saying is he that doesn't equal love. That's, that's just not comfortability. That's comfortable. Yeah, I thank you. You said yeah. it. That's smart, man. You said she's it. I just was gonna say it. at that point. It's just a habit. Yeah. That's like oh, you just, know wherever you go, you going back to this nigga. Yeah. Like, like I've got this person here. Regardless. So he's like a. He's like so a, you're telling he's me like a, he's like a savings account. So G, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. So G, she can she, she can do that for ten years. Yeah. My man's still gonna be there, fam. I know, but that's what I'm saying. Then when she then when then when then when she wants to fully. Hang, uh, hang up, you know, the yeah. duties after a shit been stretched mileage. Yeah, I know, but he don't know about this. Yeah, to him, his exactly. girl is like... But that's what I'm normal, saying. Like, yeah, but that's what I'm saying. The the love and that can't coincide because... We can't. That, well, that's you cool. can't, you that's can't even say that she don't love him, though. Yes, yeah, I can. can. Because you can't be causing actions, someone... Actions and words that are That amount of like... First of all, it's disrespectful, number one. That's yeah. just, it is disrespectful. Yeah. But the reason why she didn't tell him or she's keeping it away from him is because she don't want to hurt his feelings. No, because yeah. she doesn't want to have an uncomfortable I'm conversation. No, that's a fact. She <laughs> does, she's scared. No, she's, ca- she's a no, coward, that's basically. True. That's true. And that's women, women, women do that a lot. They they blame you for not wanting to tell you the truth. At this point, she's just she's just <laughs> like, building up right. the, the courage. Okay, but okay, but I did... No, she's okay. not building up shit from... On a real though, I did see some sense in, in her argument mm. because you lot are saying that She's not in love with him if she's able to do that to him. But I argue that she is in love with him because she's doing that to him. Wow. And listen, 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 wow. listen, listen, wow. listen, listen, hey, listen, listen, hey, listen, 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 listen. Let me, let me land my argument and maybe you, you, you tri- might understand a bit more. So you're in a relationship with this guy for seven years or for five years or whatever. So she had three or four years of that relationship where she wasn't fucking, it was just them and... Do you know what I mean? And then she realized that her sexual appetite is way more than he can give her. Does that make sense? Yeah. Not okay. Instead of breaking his heart and leaving him and dumping him or whatever, listen, listen, listen. <laughs> Instead of doing that, she decides to just start fucking niggas behind his back. No. But that's why. That's, 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 you got to know that. But, but, you know but is that not real love, Yo. though? But you know what? Yeah. <laughs> no. Stop, stop, stop. Yo. You're never going to convince her. Just, just stop. But you, man. Yo. <laughs> let me let me play devil's advocate. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, go on, go on. See, yeah, yeah I'm, I'm starting to convince you. Go no, on. you're not. You're not. Uh, go on, go on. You're saying that, right? <laughs> mm-hmm. And I kind of understand in via a woman's view. To them, that yeah. makes a hundred percent sense. That's, that's what she said to me. That, that's, but to and, them, that makes a hundred percent sense. I was sense. like, she kind of do got a point. But the funny but, thing is, yeah. right? She, you might be saying like, oh, it's gonna break his heart, rah rah rah. Yeah. She could tell him, and he'll be like. I've been waiting for this day. <laughs> oh, that's true, actually. He could that's be no ready for it. He could be ready for it. Nah, yeah. then he's a he's a plonker as well, cause. Like, but you, when you say ready for this day, you mean yeah, like as in uh, he's he could be like yeah, I'm down with it. And so that he. But can why does he need her? Yeah. To, like, that's a weird. That's then you're a weirdo. Or he might be like, situation. oh, I'll try it. Yeah, like we can we can go for it. Hey, nah, man, that like, don't make sense, man. For, for me, I wouldn't be in a relationship with someone that wants to fuck other people. Definitely not. I yeah. wouldn't do that. But I would fuck a girl who's in a relationship that her boyfriend allows her to fuck other people. You w- Wouldn't you do that? But you wouldn't know. No. You wouldn't know if the boyfriend is it allows her to most, do so. Most, most of these women say it. Exactly. Because, they say that. But is it factual? No, no. But as in, as in, it may not be. I don't know. Exactly. But, but I can tell by their actions. If their boyfriend don't know about it, they're not picking up the phone while they're with me. They're not like, Texting yeah. or the, the, yeah, phone. the phones, do you know, the phones screen, like screen down. Do you, do you know yeah, what I mean? Yeah, like, there's yeah. there's a whole routine that they yeah, got but that, planned but and you, like you mastered key, down. The key word you what? said is if the boyfriend allows it. Yeah, no, the but boyfriend. that's what I'm saying. When the boyfriend does allow it, this bitch is picking up the phone like, yeah, no, no, I'm, I'm about to leave now. Yeah. I'm coming soon. Like, do you know what I mean? So okay. it's no, that's their that's their agreement, and obviously I'm sure that he's over there fucking other bitches or whatever, like doing his thing. But when the guy don't know, that's when it gets a bit tricky. Mm. Do you get what I'm saying? And back to the conversation. Oh, of them how could you not, not not see that this girl really does love this guy? Because she, because I actually believe she does love him. I actually do. I'm not, and I'm not even just saying that just to trigger you guys. I think she actually does love him, but she doesn't want to face the fact that that relationship could end 
because of how she feels sexually about their relationship. Okay. So then sacrifice your sexual urge, blood. If you love the Donny, As... do you know the amount? Of, do you know? Hey, Amen. Do you this know the amount of sacrifice that you have? To, have to... Yeah. Okay. So As the then... side nigga in this situation. So. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. What? What? Who? You. Oh, like, you, did, you did sound like you were deciding what? <laughs> Man, we're so passionate about it yeah, just yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay Hypothetically Hypothetically yes. <laughs> Do you just fucking Put a nigga on blast and Do shit, you like... give her Genuine advice Oh yeah Yeah And that's and that's why I'm actually having This conversation here okay. And I told her I was going to talk about it On the podcast So it's cool And defend her honour Because <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Cool Hey man, I have to get I have to get some more pussy from her. So, oh, like, well, that's crazy! So like, you know what I mean? Yeah. Not sure in the but team anyway, cheated. <laughs> I think fam, when she really loves when she really loves a nigga, fam. Hey when man, she clocks, fam. But to answer, to <laughs> then answer she had a kid out of wedlock, fam. Oh, good. <laughs> nah, man, I'm always strapped up, bro. Uh, no, I wasn't talking about you. If I was just yeah, saying no. when, like, when you talk about kids, like that's a bit. <laughs> <laughs> Come making jokes like that, like. She ain't had a year yet, so I'm not making fun of the kid. That's true. No, no, but I'm saying like, because when you say wet log, I thought you were talking about. With, no, uh, I'm like, saying yeah, niggas yeah, that yeah. she's fucking. I'm saying, I'm saying, nah, not not the guy. Nah, I'm saying when my man finds out. Yeah. And then, yeah, she dips because it's like she's already she's. She's already like halfway out the relationship because yeah. she's doing, she's doing that. Yeah. Then she finds a nigga. Then she gets cheated on, and she might have a kid out. You know what I mean? Oh, fair enough. Yeah, fair, fair enough. Mm. But yeah, man. I mean, I, 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 I guess like that sometimes. But to answer his question though, I do give her real advice, like well, honest advice from my experience. Yes. Yeah. <clears throat> because that's what prompted me to come and ask you guys like. Could a girl actually convince you to let her fuck? There's so no she's going to listen to this? No, no, no. I'm not, I'm, this is the advice that I gave her, actually, before okay. we move on. You should tell him. Yeah. You should just tell him. Just tell him, yo, look. Your sex game is not good enough. No, don't say it like that. Well, uh, well obviously, I'm saying it like a, a, the way a guy would say it. Obviously, a girl would like pamper a bit more and be like, well, you know, like, it just doesn't hit the G spot. Whatever, like, you know what I mean? Explain to him that you're not satisfied and you're a bit more of a freak than what he can deliver. So, see if he's open to having well, an open relationship. Yeah, oh, but, wait, wait, wait. Stop, wait, wait, but, wait, wait, why not? Stop you there. Let me but stop why you there. not? Let me stop you there. Because you said, like, oh, you're more of a freak than he can deliver, right? Yeah. Girls do this thing where when they're in a relationship, What's wrong with they that? don't want to be freaky because they feel like, Oh, they if, get he's, too comfortable if he's treating me like this, it depends. He's, and then they let other niggas mash it out, mash it out. Hey, it depends on the girl, bro. I've it been, does depend. I've been in a relationship with a girl where, like, she. Now, nah, I mean, I was happy to go it, home to bed. That, I'm, <laughs> <laughs> I'm telling you, it's not that. But it's not that. I get. Um, I do get what you mean. Most women don't. They don't show out I unless they're being a hoe. I don't know. Why. I don't know. Why. You don't and know. That's why niggas I don't know love hoes, bro. Because yeah. it doesn't. And that's why niggas love hoes. Yeah. It is very backwards. It is very backwards. But they want you to give spend you that life porn star sex. But, but, but still, the question remains though. Like, what's wrong with her going with my advice and just. Bro, everything just that came out of your mouth <laughs> is wrong. I can't lie. Literally, You've been saying me, every some word. For me, though. Questionable <laughs> shit. There's all the time. Like, bro. I wouldn't do that, but from pers- from listening um, to her yeah. and listening to what the, the dilemma yeah, is in her relationship. The perspective is you got to tell her, like, you got, like, if you're not be, you just have to talk. Like if you have to talk about it, yeah, but you can't say I'm a go for other niggas. Are you good with that? That's wild. Yeah, because at that the point the thing's problem... already done. Okay, if you're you okay, if you talk, if you talk, okay, me. let's let's hypothetically you talk about that situation. Yeah. Ah, uh, your sex game is not good enough. Okay. Where, where, where else is it leading to? You have to. Okay, like, you have to, Maybe up. you're better off talking well, about how to improve that experience. I know, and I'm gonna be real. And break up. Oh, so you. You're trying to tell her to teach the nigga how to improve it. Well, yeah, that's yeah. better than. I think that's step one. No, that might be. It's, it's, either, like, it's either that it's or. It's step one. It. If niggas will listen but to women, though. Niggas don't niggas listen. Niggas are willing to listen, it, though. Women it's are like, willing if to listen. Nah, niggas if, if, get if, bruised. If easily, it's truly so love, like how you're true. talking about, right? Yeah. Then I guess he will listen. Or well, it wasn't we'll love, is it? Well, hear this. After five years, yeah. Yeah, no, I ain't got no force on that. The only problem I have here is that she didn't have the conversation. And the only reason she didn't have the conversation is because she's scared. Yeah, yeah, of course. 
Of course. But we can move on from that. Nah, I, can. I can't convince you niggas to let other niggas to fucking Ain't go. No so way. It's, yeah, we can, <laughs> we can convince me. That's <laughs> wow. Yeah, that's crazy. That's crazy. That's crazy. Convince. <laughs> like, that's a badge of honour to let... Yeah. Gee, you know what? You know what's mad? <laughs> but, yeah? but, who's that? Who's that? Who's that? Donny that was on um, oh, oh, off the record podcast, and he said he'll let Drake fuck his bitch, fam. Like, oh my god, I know who you're talking bro, about. That, that's yeah. fucking blood, and yeah, it's a crazy. badge of honor. Oh, no, because you were saying like you know when you have the oh conversation. But well, who said that? That's you know crazy. how some people have the conversation in relationships like. Who's your free pass? Like, or like the celebrity, celebrity free, free pass. pass? Yeah. Nah, I hate that conversation. If I have the chance to beat Rihanna, I'm taking it. Oh yeah, I am. I'm, taking but it. I'm not telling my girl if Drake is there in the same room, you can go. Nah, people. but no, the way my man was crazy. Oh, no. He was excited. But he was like, yeah, yeah. Said, I know, but that's a fanboy. Yeah. It's a fanboy. Drake, thing, huh? That's a fanboy. That's thing. an idiot, fam. Yeah. But we say Boy, that. We, want, we say game. that. But even yeah, a lot of famous thing. niggas get that off where they beat the same girls. That's true. That's like, a very wait, good point. say that again. Even a lot of famous niggas get that off where they beat the same girls and just pass around the same like four women. Yeah, but thing. like the fact that you you're saying yeah, like I would be honoured if Drake fucks my bitch. Like, <laughs> that shit there. That's weird. That's right. why you don't be look honoured. Like, that's a weird. Oh, that's came out the blood, bro. I said, oh, when I... that's what he said. Yo, <laughs> that's what he said. He said yes, he it's, he's like, it's, he's like, it's Drake, man. Everyone's like, yo, you know, know, I would be on this like, crazy. Jesus Christ, like, I would like, be on this crazy. That's, Isn't that's, it? That's, like, that's, that's, that almost sounds like you want to fuck that nigga. Yeah, <laughs> that's what it sounds like. like nah, let's, let's, don't shower, don't shower. Come straight, like, nah, let's not lie. Fam. If, if it was, <laughs> what you say, legacy? Like, don't shower, like, come straight. <laughs> like I'm trying to. <laughs> That's wild. To that's actually crazy. get one to shower after yeah, you fuck Drake. That is wild. Now, nah, let's be honest. If it was Jesus, you're probably a liar, fam. Nah, I'm not allowing that. So if, if, okay, if I, I, I got, okay, I got, I got one then. Yeah. Go on. If Jesus says, for you yeah. to get to heaven, I have to fuck your thing. I said... I, 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 I've always preferred the summer yeah. to winter. Yeah. 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 Jesus is yeah. one I, 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 tell, I tell Jesus to give me the directions to hell, bro. Bro, where is it? Where is it? Is it left or right? Where are we going? Bro. Hey. Come on. That is, yeah. And, and I'll tell him, you need to come with me for that, <laughs> for what right. you just said. I need five minutes, Jesus. <laughs> for what yeah, you just said. That's crazy. You, like, I'm about to tell God what you just said. That's wild. <laughs> I know, but, hey. Oh, shit. Hey, man. But, I. Right. Mm. When, have you not ever been dating a girl yet? Yeah? Because, every, obviously, every man in here has had a thing that you, you've yeah. been speaking to for a while. Mm-hmm. And then they've met your family, right? Not met my family, but. Well, you've never had a girl meet your family? No. Like, ever? None. Damn. No, I have. Bro? Hey, no, I'm going to be real. Look, yeah, because the closest that even happened was I must have been FaceTiming one. And hell, I, my, 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 your mom, my your mom, mom walked just, in and she, and she, and like, and she waved. Like Not even like that, but my mom waved at her, bro, and it was just awkward oh, as hell. Yeah, <laughs> and it was awkward as hell, my boy. And, and your mom's be trying to get in yeah, there. Yeah, they're like, trying oh, to get in there. Yeah, who's that? Oh, and I'm oh like, she's so that, pretty. Wait, wait, yeah, the worst one is like, oh, is that Denise? And it's like, mom. Don't say that. I haven't been chatting about you to my mom. Mom, this is not, this is, this is. Oh, my God. This is Lara, mom. Come on, mom. I'm glad not do that. I'm saying the wrong name as well. Yikes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. My mom's done that before. Yeah, yeah. Oh, my really? mom's done that before. Yeah, so sabotaged. It didn't. It didn't. Actually, that's kind of questionable. It didn't. It didn't make her not come back. Oh, okay. Which is questionable. When oh, you think about it. How, yeah, much, kinda, how much self-esteem do you have for yourself? She'd be ashamed. But <laughs> <laughs> but it almost ruined. It almost ruined the pattern. Like mm. calling the girl a wrong name. Like now she's asking us. So who's Denise? Like I don't know who that is. My mom just makes up names. Like. What are you talking about? But when they meet your family, right? I know you've never had this happen before to you, but you, you two have, right? I have. You've had, yeah, yeah, you had a girl that met your family. When they meet your family, at that point, is it fair for women to... I'm asking this outright because I know how I feel about this already. Is it fair for women to, for, for a, a female to feel like your, relation, your relationship is now at a level where you have to be exclusive and give her everything? Because you've taken her around your family. No, I wouldn't say... Oh, you go first. No, no, you go, you go, go. I wouldn't say give her everything, but I would <coughs> say it depends on, like, it depends on the individual. Because some guys, some guys bring things to the yard, I've seen it, parents know, but it's like, it's kind of like, you know when, you know when the, the Becky's on that, yeah? yeah. They, um, man them can go, like, okay, I'll give you one story, yeah? Yeah, go on. So one of our Jews was... was Dealing with this this girl in it, um, some Becky thing, yeah. And, uh, <laughs> yeah. And, uh, <laughs> I don't know where this is going, but go on. No, nah, it's wild, yeah. 
and the whole family knew. The whole family was there, just calm, chilling. Yeah, fam. yeah. And his and and the daughter went upstairs. Yeah, and she and he was sitting downstairs in the sitting room. She came back down with underwear. Yeah, and to to Swear say and down. called called him to say come upstairs. Parents are not. They knew. Get her calm. The dad hit him with, give her an extra one for me. Wait, what? Say swear Yo. to God. Say swear. Say swear. He's like, 